actually the best day of the year at the University of Miami. But today represents our outreach into the community. We started this based on student athletes, but it's grown tremendously. Today we'll have chess players and leaders in their schools. It's more how can you use these activities and your leadership potential to grow right now in your community and help us build in the city of Miami. So leadership isn't about winning, it's about how you bounce back, how you uh, get back from adversity, how you, how you fall, how you fail, how you deal with the mistakes, it's about the mindset. Young men and women, you did not start this life just to start. You start to finish. You are here to do something great. No matter what, someone somewhere else knows more than you. And that is nothing to hide from. Admit it. Because the gap between where you are right now and where you're going to be when you're awesome, that gap right there, attack it. Attack it. Don't be scared of it. Enjoy it. But in order to attack it, you have to admit it. You have to find out what you don't know, because the learn-it-alls are better than the know-it-alls. She told you how it was. When coaches, like, they try to sugarcoat it, oh, everything's going to be all right, we got this. No, she lets them know you, have, you can't be have all this confidence. You have to know what you are, what you can do, and perfect that to your full potential. The way I look at leadership is first you have to have the ability to lead yourself before you try to lead anybody else. And I start with leadership with core values. What are your core values? You're learning things that you don't know. Just like what Jamal said, he said, there's a lot of people out here that know a lot more than you do. So maybe you should just listen. And the eight C's are the qualities, the values that Jamal was talking about that are most important to us. And the eight C's are simply this, character, competitiveness, competence, consistency, cohesiveness, commitment, communication, and confidence. All my life, they've been telling me no, but all I did was work hard and I got to where I am today. So when somebody tells you no, make, it, make them fear you so you can tell them yes and that you can be the greatest that you ever could be. The mistakes that you make, that's where you learn the most. That's, that's what you need to learn from it. I believe that, that there's winning and there's there's learning. And there's failure when you're not learning from failures. At every level you're going to face some sort of challenge. But you have to remember your dream in your heart and you have to protect your dream. Because if you don't protect it and nourish it, no one else will.